And we're joined right now by the Erie Otters, Alex Dabrinkit, who uh, has had a couple big seasons, including playing one with Connor McDavid. As we continue our coverage from the 2016 NHL Scouting Combine, Bob Stoffer with you on the Oilers Radio Network. And Alex, what's, what's this experience this week been like for you? Uh, it's been pretty fun. I mean, uh, not too many people get to do this, and it's definitely something that I'll remember my, the rest of my life. Now, I can tell you got a little bit of a chill going in the voice, so you've been fighting a little bit of uh, a little bit of the flu, and haven't exactly been at 100%, have you? No, uh, I mean this week's been uh, tough in the interviews without a voice. So, uh, but I mean, I kind of had to battle through it and just kind of get through the meetings. I think there's a lot of people in Edmonton that would hope I'd lose my voice once in a while, but I digress. Uh, you had a chance to play with Connor last year. Uh, Dylan Strom back this season as well. You guys had another great year, scored a ton of goals. Uh, but you were a guy that's been, you know, there's an old saying, right? Big men have to prove they can't play, and little guys have to prove they can. And, uh, you know, you've been able to do that the last couple of years over in, in the OHL. To what do you credit, uh, you know, the sort of success that you've had in that league to this point? Um, I think my teammates. I mean, uh, without the two teams that we had in the area, I don't think I would do nearly as well as I did. So um, definitely them and, and also the coaching staff. Uh, they worked countless hours with me after and trying to round up my game and, and get it better as, as, we, as the season went on. Now, uh, you're in a situation where, you know, you're a guy that can score. We know that about you. How many teams expressed interest in you here? How many teams did you end up interviewing? Uh, I met with 21 teams, so uh, a good amount. But, uh, I mean, there's still a few that that don't don't like me. So uh, Is that what you think they don't like you, or do you think maybe there might be interviews at a later date? Um, maybe there might be. I mean, uh, I don't think necessarily they don't like me. I think uh, maybe I'm just not their guy right now, or or there will be interviews at the at a different date. So uh, we'll just have to wait and see. You uh, played in the uh, World Junior Championship as well. You got a little bit nicked up uh, there, but what was that experience like? It was fun. Um, I mean, I had a great time there. Obviously, the hockey didn't really go my way, but <coughs> you can sorry, your voice. That's okay. it was a great group of guys, and. Um, uh, I wouldn't change it for a thing, I don't think. It was it was a really fun experience. All right, and is there anywhere to compare and contrast uh, playing with Connor McDavid uh, or playing with Dylan? I mean, just, I mean, you talked about your teammates, but just a quick thought on playing with Connor and what that experience was like last year. Um, I mean, it was pretty cool. Um, he's probably the best player I've ever played with or seen play. So, um, I mean, he, he's unbelievable. Uh, there's just not too many people that, that can compare. I mean, Dylan's pretty close, but uh, Connor plays with so much speed and, and uh, is so good with the puck. It's pretty unbelievable. I lied. One final question. Biggest area you need to improve upon um, to, uh, to get to the next level? Uh, I think my speed. Um, being my size, I'm not going to make it to the NHL without uh, being really fast. So I think I want that extra gear and um, even it proves my acceleration. Acceleration, I mean, um, <clears throat> that those are two things that I really need to work on. and. Um, I think that's going to lead me to the NHL. All right, well, Brendan Gallagher had three 40-goal seasons with the uh, Vancouver Giants. Some have compared you a bit to a Brendan Gallagher type of player who's feisty, high energy. That's Alex Dabrinkit of the Erie Otters, and we'll continue our ongoing coverage from the 2016 NHL Scouting Combine.